Okay, what you can see here is again we got our set point, the desired RPM and our actual RPM. They're very close and to hold them close we're putting about uh, a tenth of a volt here. And you can see if I dial the set point down, watch what happens. See how the voltage goes up? That voltage goes up to put more brake on it to bring the actual RPM more in line with the set point RPM. I'm going to go back to where it was, roughly. And if you go over here and look at our screen, you can see we're cruising along nice. I did that, brought it down, and now it's going to go back to some RPM. Okay. Now I want to show you something uh, where if you just watch this screen, I'm going to apply more load to the dyno. And you can see we were holding RPM somewhat good, but you can see it went up. I'm going to get a little more low. And you can see we're holding better than no control, but it still went up some. What I'm going to do is show you this set thing right here, which I can do by control H for hold. And you can see how it's holding now? If we go back to our display here, you see how I've added the integral is now coming into it. I've added integral, and what the integral tries to do is it looking long term and modifying this. If these are different over a period of 10 or 20 seconds, the integral starts to tweak itself. So if we come back here, you can see we're holding RPM very close to what the set point is, and the advantage of this is only when you're trying to hold RPM constant like tuning a, a, an engine and want to hold, let's say, 60 miles an hour. Now I'm going to show you what happens if I back the uh, throttle off. You're going to see it drop some, but you're going to see it want to come back to pretty much where it was as the integral value over here starts going away, or a combination of integral and proportional gives less voltage to it. You're going to see it come back to approximately where it started and hold it. So by doing the control H or if you click up here and click on set, hold steady or allow changing, I'm going to go back to allow changing here. And now I've taken the integral off and you can see it's not working as well. And you can see here the integral went away and now we only have proportional and differential affecting this voltage out here. Which will still somewhat work, it's just not as good as holding steady as when you do control H.